Hi everyone, it's Cass. Welcome back to my channel, What Cass Read. Today, I am surrounded by a pile of books because I have no idea what possessed me to take all these books off my shelf and film this, but I wanted like a visual catalog. I just wanted to know how many book series am I currently reading? So these are all the books that are currently on my shelf that represent some type of series that I am currently in the middle of. I haven't even counted. It's not as bad as I thought it would be, but it's still pretty bad. <laughs> and then at the very end, if you see a book series in here that you're like, that needs to be your next one to finish, let me know in the comment section below. These are in no particular order. We're just gonna get started. Okay, this right here, this is Caliban's War, written by James S.A. Corey. This is book number two of the Expanse series. This is Age of War, book number three of the Legends of the First Empire series, written by Michael J. Sullivan. I have In an Absent Dream, written by Shauna McGuire. This is book number four of the Wayward Children series. This is Saga, book number two. I have already finished this one, but I am still in the middle of the saga series. So I need to finish seven through nine. I think that's where I'm at. Seven through nine, then I'll be all caught up on Saga, written by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples. I can't believe I forgot about this one. This is Bloody Rose, written by Nicholas Ames. This is book number two of his The Bands series, so it's the sequel to Kings of the Wild. Ooh, I'm ashamed to see that I didn't finish this one yet either. This is Blood Witch, written by Susan Dennard, book number three of the Witchland series. We have The Republic of Thieves, written by Scott Lynch, book number three of the Gentleman Bastard sequence. <laughs> I know I brought this one up before. This is Words of Radiance, written by Brandon Sanderson, book number two of the Stormlight Archive. This is a series that I never thought I'd still want to continue, but this is Sword of Destiny, written by Andrzej Sapkowski. This is technically book number two in the Witcher series, but it's the second book of short stories before the novels begin. If you know the Witcher series, you know what I'm talking about. I have Blameless, written by Gail Carriger. This is book number three of the Parasol Protectorate series. This is Descender Volume 1, written by Jeff Lemire and Dustin Wynn. So I finished this one already, and now I need to continue on with Volume 2. And I know I just recently mentioned this book a couple of times. This is Wrath, book number four of the Faithful and the Fallen series, written by John Gwynn. This is Clockwork Prince, written by Cassandra Clare, book number two of the Infernal Devices trilogy. This is Twelve Kings and Sherikai, written by Bradley Baleo. This is book number one of the Song of the Shattered Sands series. I got very... I didn't get very far in this book, but this was like a book that I didn't DNF forever. It's just a book that I still haven't yet continued with. I have Shorefall, written by Robert Jackson Bennett. This is book number two of the Founder series. I'm actually waiting on book number nine. This is Written in My Own Heart's Blood, written by Diana Gabaldon. And this is book number eight of the Outlander series. At this point, it's like, will I buy book number nine when it comes out? I don't know. But I love Jamie Fraser. hate the writer. I, I don't know yet. So <laughs> this is on my shelf still. This is The School for Good and Evil, written by Soman Chainani. This is book number two, A World Without Princes, um, of the School for Good and Evil series. It's a middle grade series. I read book number one forever ago. This is The Kingdom of Copper, written by S.A. Chakraborty. This is book number two of the Dave Abba trilogy. And that book is a part of my Goodreads challenge, so I should be getting to that book soon. Another book that I can't believe is on my shelf still that I haven't finished yet. This is The Girl in the Tower, written by Catherine Arden, book number two of the Winter Night trilogy. This is just shameful that I I haven't even got, I know, this is super shameful at this point that I haven't worked on this series recently. This is The Subtle Knife, written by Philip Pullman, book number two of the, um, come on, His Dark Materials trilogy. I have The Wise Man's Fear, written by Patrick Rothfuss. Of course, this is book number two of the King Killer Chronicles, and we're all awaiting Doors of Stone, book number three, but I just had to mention this one because... This is a series that I'm currently reading. I have The Faded Sky, written by Mary Robinette Kowal. This is book number two of the Lady Astronaut series. Book number one was The Calculating Stars. This is Charmcaster, written by Sebastian de Castell. This is book number three of the Spellslinger series. And I finished this one, so now I just need to finish books four, five, and six. Why is this still halfway read by now? Um, I think I'm like 70% of the way through this. This is Fool's Assassin, written by Robin Hobb. We are so close. We are so close to the end. And it's, of course, just, it's a slow read. It's a slow read. And I'm, I'm like, every time I look at this, I'm like, why haven't you finished this book yet? This book, all right, I will say this. And I know I've said this before already. Um, I got through like 60% of the way through it. And it has broken my heart probably five times uh, up until now. And we have two more books to go in this whole 
whole massive series and I don't even know what I have in store for me. Ooh, we have Percy Jackson, um, book number two. This is called The Sea of Monsters, written by Rick Riordan. This is an author that you're probably not used to seeing in my videos. This is Finders Keepers, written by Stephen King. This is book number two of the Bill Hodges trilogy. And I really want to continue on with this trilogy. It was like just the right amount of like detective police procedural, but creep, super creepy. Mm, I did really like this series. Here I have The Blinding Knife written by Brent Weeks. This is book number two of the Lightbringer series. I don't know how many videos you've seen this one, this book in yet. Jade War written by Fonda Lee, book number two of the Greenbone Saga. If you haven't read Jade City yet, what are you waiting for? I also am in the middle of the Imperium trilogy. This is King's Bane, book number two, written by Claire Legrand. Book number three, is that supposed to come out this year? I think so. I think the final book is supposed to come out this year. This book wasn't my favorite, but I do want to see how it wraps up. So that's why I'm still waiting for it. I have Scarlet Tides, written by David Hare. This is book number two of the Moontide Quartet. Really enjoyed book number one, but haven't made a priority to pick up book number two yet. So we'll see when I get to this one. Of course, you've seen this book around too. This is Wondersmith, written by Jessica Townsend. I am waiting on Holopox. It is coming out in October. That is book number three of the Nevermore series. And then the last series that I'm currently in the middle of, this is Air of Fire, a Throne of Glass novel. This is book number three of the Throne of Glass series written by Sarah J Moss. I wonder what my final count is. I'll put my final count up somewhere. Um, yeah, I'm really anxious to see what this will look like at the end of it all. But if there's a series in here that you think that I absolutely need to prioritize as my very next series, please put it in the comment section below. You can also follow me on my social media if you want. I'm on Twitter and Instagram. It's at WitCastRed, the same as this channel, so it should be super easy for you to find. And then, of course, my Goodreads account that is always listed and linked down below. And you know how these videos end. I'll talk to you later. Bye.